Must find where Baldur's Gate is right over the hills. Casador and his rite of profane ascension. A grand ceremony to honor one exalted vampiric master. To place him in a position of such esteem. The world will yearn to kneel and offer. Of course I envy him. The problem with what Casador has done is that he did it to me. If the time comes and I can stay one move ahead of him, I'll take his place before his blood can hit the floor. After 200 years of shit, pure shit! Look, I appreciate All I'm saying is let's be clever about it. If an opportunity arises for me to become a more magnet, let's find out more. If we track down my old comrades, the other spawn, we may discover more and be finely positioned. My, my, you... If we don't find my brethren, they'll find us. We should get to them first. Then we can make their pretty tongues talk. Unless Cazador has changed their orders, they'll be in the dens of this town, seeking... With haste. The city is close now. My former peers will be watching, no doubt. Waiting for my return. We should do what we can to find them. What they know could help us. Excuse me, I can't find my mum. She was, um, she was sick. She had spots on her face and that was last ten day though. Guards blow like petards. They don't help us. That means you don't come back. My mum is coming back, though. She's looking for me. If you see her, tell her Yenna's looking for her. Turn back, citizen. No passage in this direction. It's bloodier than a butcher's backyard out there. Piles of dead absolutists, and a few of our own. The cultists assaulted the gate, armed to the t They nearly had it too, before the steel watch intervened. <laughs> a You'll see for yourself soon enough if you head... I'm never allowed sweet things right before bed. This one time will make an exception. What the hell's was that? Whatever it is doesn't bode well. Curse to put my hands on everything. Again, I feel stalked. There's an invitation behind its great brown.
donations. Do you know what advice? If you don't have anything to donate, you can get going. Well, if you must. But what are you... I have something to ask. You did me a real favor clearing all those ghouls out of me. That old bone bag Ketherick had some fancy junk stashed behind all the cobwebs and wish I could tell you. We're stuck out here, but most of the action is beyond Worms Crossing. Didn't you? Figured we only got the scraps you didn't have the strength to carry. Still, we got some decent stuff. Would I try to fool a Sharpie like you? Have a look. Well, hello. Watch your back. Return to your homes. That's an order. You best not piss away, man. It Supplies are short. But I can scrape it up together for everyone to have a bite of something solid. <laughs> Even if we only have tankers of river water to raise. We'll drink to their memory. You're all 
right. My gods, you're all right. Come here, darling. I was so scared I'd lost you. Me too. But we're here now. Safe. Maybe not. But we have each other now. We... So many more could have survived if we... If I... They got me signed up to learn to make pots, which is dumb. I'd rather learn how to kill cultists. I'm really worried about Umi. I'm bushed. I ran for days to get someplace safe and then found out I'm last in line to get in because I'm a hobgoblin. As if I could change that. I had it easy compared to the rest of you. Hail, friend. Fine day, isn't it? Forgive me, you're in no mood to talk about the weather. Your journey here was a hard one. Is this your first time in Baldur's Gate? It's a fine city, isn't it? No better place to hail from. Used to be you'd arrive knowing you had a full belly and a warm bed waiting for you. Not anymore. These days, there's belly enough to go around. I had the refugees on top and well. Folk aren't feeling too generous. I've been asking myself the same question. I wouldn't be the first to interfere. Some well-to-do's in the city donated enough to see the newcomers right for the time being. Only they didn't bother helping everyone else. Locals going without while strangers feast. It stoked the fire, all right. Some Baldarians are kicking up a fuss round the front of the barn as we speak. If I wasn't wearing this uniform, I'd walk round there and teach him a lesson. I'd never forget. Too bloody right. They've gone soft behind those walls, forgotten what it's like to struggle, living hand to mouth. I say we march round there and slit a few bellies, remind them how much worse things could be. What do you say? Why does it matter? Innocence makes the blood run clearer. So, you're the lick spittle who crushed the Bone Lord's thrall. Have you come begging, sniffing for our stones? Gortash won't like that. A throat his black hand can't choke the spit from. You'll need to bleed and carve this city if you want to turn him to grave meat. He shivers at the thought. <laughs> when you find the Lordling, tell him Oren is watching. So Orin is a shapeshifter. How long has she been watching? Actually, got here safely. Towing along my wife, sister, and mother. Or maybe they towed me up. If you're here to fill an empty stomach, look elsewhere. Folks swarmed what little was odd, stuffing their pockets. 
bloody animals. No traps, please. Welcome, friend. You've joined us as we honor our fallen dead. A somber time, and you've brought a somber guest. I did not think you would willingly return, Spawn. Well, indeed. I was rather hoping I'd never see you people again. Honestly. Frey, Valdisk Durovna. Frey, Valdisk Ablast. I feel we're intruding. We should leave quickly. Calm yourself. You will not be harmed. Our leader has called off the hunt. She wishes to speak to you. Im orak nete. Trasin netra. So, the impossible spawn walks among us in the blazing sun. We have been looking for you. The last time your friend came to our camp, he stole our children, our future. When I was hunting you, I was to bring you back here, interrogate you, discover how to save our children, and then destroy you. But things have changed. You have changed. Is it true you left your master? That you broke the spell that binds you to him? Uh, well, I, I mean, uh, kind of. It's a long story, honestly. One is just as important as the other, I find. And our luck has been poor. We have tried to save our children once already, attacking Kazadorzar's palace at first light. Even then, it was too well defended. But if his own spawn approached, someone he thought he could control, he would throw his doors open and welcome you in. And once inside, you could do what we could not. You could save the children you damned. You don't know Kazador like I do. He's merciless. You want me to march into the lion's den and save your children? But I promise you, they're already dead. Excuse me, did you not hear anything I just... I know our plight is grim, but if there is even a chance to save them, we must take it. If our children are truly gone, then we ask for blood. I know you can understand that, Spawn. I suppose. Yes. Yes. Revenge I can do. Thank you. From me and all my people. If you can do this, we will be in your debt. You have lived a life of violence and sin. You have stolen lives, broken families, and caused immeasurable grief. Doing this will not right those wrongs. <laughs> if you're trying to encourage me, you're failing abysmally. But it will be a start. You may still be redeemed. Please go. Time is short. But we will see you again when it is done. Our judgment and it almost doomed us. We need strategy and cool. Do not stand. I should mind my step.
don't mind if I do. Seems simple enough. Arguing with the guards. We're not getting past that checkpoint without the right papers. Get us inside the city. city. Oh, I saw the giant oh, monsters guarding the checkpoint. It's the way it's looking up. A few days in a checkpoint. Worst that can happen is one of those steel leeches stamping us into the dirt. the unconscious body of a mind flayer, glistening and raw. A newborn, unattended. How fortunate. Oh, but it is. This one has only just transformed. It is weak, vulnerable, its potential ripe for harvesting. Go on, kill it. Absorb its power, just like you did before. Come no closer, you. You. What are you? What am I sensing? You are like me. Like I was. A vessel yet to transform. Help me. I am so hungry. My vessel. He fought the transformation. He found it excoriating. I can still taste his terror. We need to feed. We need a brain fresh and frantic to restore our strength. Good take. Just like you did before. What? No! I've had...
here we go. These boots have seen everything. And what's the worst that can happen if we get caught sneaking in? A few days and it's... Do me a favour. Box my ears in. I can't listen to any more whining about missing letters. You're such a scaredy cat. The Circus of the Last Days has returned. See Dryad's Gin and Dribbles the Clown back with a new act. Why don't we see if we can find the perfect weapon for... I provide a personalised service for... Tell me, how do you like to kill? I see. Playing to your strengths. Keep it... And when you kill someone, what do you feel? Killing holds no fear for you, does it? You understand what it takes and what it gives. One more question, if you'll humour me. Do you think you could turn your weapon on those closest to you? There's a killer inside you, isn't there? It wouldn't take much to push you over the edge. I see. Gortash knows you are coming. Knows you have the Bone Lord's stone. Do not let him hiss hot air into your worm-weakened brain. Oh, no. You could kill him. Let him close and make him feel the tickle of your blade between his ribs. <laughs> Remember... His throat spits lies, but my blade carves the truth. You will read it on your skin soon enough. She's toying with me. What does she want? I should arrest you all for gross negligence. in the hell is all of this? A necessity, good sir. The Steel Watch loves pretending sweet Rivington doesn't exist. So we have decided to protect you, dear patrons. <laughs> no need to thank us. You'll be allowed in once I've done this batch. Next! Hello, hello, and welcome to the Circus of the Last Days. The finest extra planar circus there is. We travel from plane to plane, thrilling all blessed to see us. From tempestuous Ginny to belligerent Redcaps, you'll find them all here. But enough of this. The circus is a place of joy and distraction, so uh, come inside and forget your worries. Not a problem, dear patron. Benji just has to check if you're a vicious murderer. Benji? <laughs> You smells like piss and iron. No like. Oh, well, that's a first. Usually I'd allow you in, but in these times, I can take no chances. 
Move along. No circus for you. I'm not a sucker for big eyes. Welcome to the circus of... She is miming putting on face paints. She has them to sell. beyond your tiny imagination and make your miserable life more bearable. Akabi has traveled across the plains, burning and conquering all. Win the spoils of such conquest. Or, if luck smiles upon you, win the grand... No more questions. Spin or don't. Let us see if you have luck's favor. Alas! No jackpot for you, ugly one. Yes! Drown me in coin! And perhaps you shall win the ultimate prize. Alas! No jackpot for you, ugly one! Very 
very well. Approach! Up! Spin! Oh! If let us see if you have luck's favor! Alas! No! Jackpot! Hmm. Up! Spin! No more questions! Spin or don't. Let us see if you have luck's favor. You notice a glint in Akabi's beard. As it glows, the wheel moves away from the jackpot. He is cheating. Alas! No jackpot for you, ugly one. But you may have this. You dare speak to me as if we were equals? You are a scrap of food in my teeth. The dirt beneath my fingernails. You are nothing. I am, however, feeling gracious. So I will forget this and allow you to spin again. Or I can turn you into something vile. Choose!
go. Find a way forward. What's hiding here? Spin! 
No more questions. Alas! No! I am, however, feeling gracious. So, I will forget this and allow you to... Alas! No jackpot for you, ugly one. Alas! No! Alas! 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 You Still breathing, despite everything. All right, what now? to win the grand prize. But fear not, grotesque one. I can't be...
Only faith will guide me. Pick to fight. The consequences are hard. Enjoying the show. Something's on my mind. This city of stone and steel is an endless scream in nature's womb. I have felt no peace here. Your eyes, Stira. There is pain, endless and deep, but also divine. You are bring the one you love to me. I will look into your hearts and see if your love is eternal or doomed eternally. It can't hurt, I suppose, unless you embarrass me. Then you might find yourself hurting in a whole manner of ways. Close your eyes, little ones. Be still. than nature's due. I see you. Know you. But do you know one another? Shadowheart. An endless storm. Listen. Think. From where does Shadowheart draw comfort on a cold, dark night? Well put. Though I'll forgive a middling wine so long as the company makes up the difference. Your bond beats in pleasure. The heart craves comfort, but needs respect. How does one earn the dark-haired maiden's respect? Very good. Just don't say it so loud. Our touch has been that of sunlight. But now we must ask the deep, the difficult. Shame sits in the soul of all. To tame it, we must name it. Shadowheart, what is her deepest shame? I didn't think a little game would sting so much when I agreed to this. But you're right. A perfect score. 
I'm flattered. Have you been studying up on me every night at camp? I press my finger to your bond and find a shield. Impenetrable. It is beauty. Your love is one few had. Go in peace, seedlings. And no Viola Silvertongue at your service, or I will be once my set is done.